The Who have had endless compilations of their hits, you know, sort of bolstered out with other tracks in. And uh, I must admit, I've got pretty much all the albums. Uh, I haven't really gone into the box sets except for one. Um, but I have, I haven't, I haven't veered onto the box sets. Too expensive, and you know, the, there comes a point where enough is enough, and um, you know, s spend my money on other things. <laughs> this is one that I particularly like, though. It's the Who hits fifty hits. It says, and on the front it says all the hits, picks, mixes, and misses. That's Pete Townsend. Definitive 42 track collection, digitally remastered, features the brand new track, Be Lucky. Do you ever remember his Adney Price? She used to be on the television and she was dressed as a sort of a gypsy fortune teller. And she used to always say, this is going back in the early 60s, she used to say, think lucky and you'll be lucky. She did, she did the horoscopes, things like that anyway. Right, I'll show you this album. Nice photograph of the band there, original lineup, with what looked like uh, oil drums turned on their side and painted white. Um, two CD set, that's disc two, and uh, a bit fiddly this. There's disc one with uh, a latter picture of the band. Pete and Roger, etc. And uh, a bit of a picture on the top there, on, on the um, projected to the back of the stage of the band. Uh, I think we know that image anyway. Let's just uh, take the booklet out. Sound of Triumph is in those names. Anger, comedy, beauty, power, love, sadness, forgiveness, hope, transcendence, excellence. It can all be found in two of the shortest and most complex words. The Who, 50 years on. The Who stand alone and together with their only true peers. The Beatles, the Rolling Stones and Bob Dylan. Early photograph of uh, The Who there. There's lots of other stuff in here over their career. Picture of John Entwistle saw there, the Ox, and Keith Moon. And uh, it says, compiled by Jamie Feldman and Andy Street. I don't think that's Andy Street that was the, uh, <laughs> the mayor of the West Midlands, having said that. Executive producers Bill Kerbishley and Robert Rosenberg remastered by John Astley at Close to the Edge. And uh, there's a nod to uh, TS. That photograph again of the oil drums. Right, I'll put it back in there. It's slightly different to the general thing that you, you, you get with their greatest hits, etc. It pans out a bit. I can't get the booklet in to do that later. Um, disc one, Zoot Suit as the high numbers. Uh, I can't explain anyway, anyhow, anywhere. My generation substitute. Kids are all right. I'm a boy. Happy Jack. Now, Happy Jack uh, brings back memories because a school friend of mine, secondary school, called Jeff Rogers. We used to go to this cafe in a road in Birmingham called Foreman's Road, and this, that was on the jukebox. And we'd play that. We'd, we'd put, I think it was a sixpence or something like that. And uh, if you nudged the jukebox, you could end up getting about, for some reason or other, about five or six other, other records. Mind you, we always wanted to keep playing Happy Jack. And I think it, uh, it annoyed a couple. Boris the Spider pictures a lily the last time I can see for miles. My mother loved that record and um, especially the black and white promo for it at the time. 
Dogs, Magic Bus, Pinball Wizard, I'm Free, The Seeker, Summertime Blues, See Me, Feel Me, Won't Get Fooled Against, the single edit that is. Uh, Let's See Action, Bargain, Behind Blue Eyes, love that, some great tracks on here. Barbara O'Reilly, uh, always reminds me of um, discos at Mac in Birmingham and uh, they'd, they'd play various things of the Who as well. Join Together, Relay, 515, Love Rain Over Me, that's Quadravenia, isn't it? Uh, Postcard, Squeezebox, Slip Kid, Who Are You? Trick of the Light, You Better You Bet, Don't Let Go, The Coat, Athena, Eminent Strunt, It's Hard, Real Good Looking Boy, um, It's Not Enough, and Be Lucky. Now, it's it, it's come out on... Um, on Universal, it says on it, on the CD, when I look at it, this compilation, 2014, excuse uh, Ruby Tuesday's tale in the back background, but um, 2014, I'm sure it wasn't that long ago that I bought this. Maybe I'm wrong, I don't know, anyhow. Uh, are you a Who fan? If you are, tell me what hits you particularly enjoyed of theirs. Uh, I'd be interested to hear that or any memories that you might have of the band. OK, uh, if you've enjoyed this, please tick a like. And if you haven't subscribed, great time to subscribe. That way you won't miss all the videos. Bye and thanks for watching.